What is up, everyone? This is Nick Gaming, and welcome back to Art of the Spirits, or just Art of the Spirits. Art of the Spirits. Now, most of you re are probably asking, uh, Ink, what are you doing here in, in the house? Did you start a new game? Did you be the high boss yet? Well, yes, actually, and no. Okay, so the reason I'm here is that because I was I was recording a video, a video, and of art, uh, and I actually be the high boss. Yay for me! But in doing so, when I came back to the house, I realized I found a bug in bug in the system, and I had to reload my game, and thus I can show you the footage of me being the high. The high, or just lost boss to his death. But, anyways, let's move on and then play the game. Okay, so this is where I encountered the glitch. It won't be it. I'm actually kind of afraid of what happened again. Oh, thank god. It didn't happen again. Give me just a second. That took a long time. Hey, you're back. Those wops give you a hard time? Nothing I can handle. I couldn't handle. Dinner is almost done. Yeah. Let's go and set the table. Alright. We're making progress slow and steady. Wow. This is... So. Huh. It's very lonely out here. Very lonely. <sighs> it's just you, me, and Mom. Everything okay, dear? Yes. It's just... Dot dot dot. I've been to this island every summer of my life. Yet, this is the first time here without her. That I'm here is almost more than I can bear. This all just brings back so many memories. I swear I can still fear her there. Me here, I'm sorry. Yoba and I turn around to see she's not there. Not anymore. Mom. God, is he I miss her so much. We all miss her. I expect that this visit brings up some emotions. But I'm sure your mother is smiling down on us and is really glad that we have kept on this tradition. I guess so. Thank you. This is actually really sad. <laughs> It'll get better. It's been a long day with the traveling and all. Maybe we should get some sleep. Everything will look different tomorrow. Because tomorrow is another day. Fredbear. Fredbear. Crazy Psychic Fredbear. Copyright. 2015. Copyright Psychic Psych Friend Fred Bear. Finance of Freddy's 4. <sighs> this is very good character development. I really. R. 
start up. Huh? Alright, uh... Where am I? Are those ghosts? Where the heck am I? I haven't been sleepwalking. I'm still on my... Just let me start around. And... Oh my god, please no. Every second step I take seems to be dimming light. This hard lesser light. Damage I please. What? But I holy crap, what's that? just happened. Wake up. It was only just a dream. Finally. Who's talking? Here. I mean, here! Where? Here where? Huh? I'm so confused as I am. A ghost! Ack! Shh! Not so loud! We don't want to wake up your parents! I can assure you, I am not a ghost. Although I understand what looks me and otherwise. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do it in my own voice. I must be dreaming still. I'm afraid you're wide right awake. Unfortunately, the situation has dictated that I reveal myself in another time. Huh. What do you mean? Arta, I have known you for a long time. Although you have been seen me before, I've been hiding in the shadows through most of your life. I've waited many years for this moment. Listen carefully. I have something important to tell you. My name is Arco. We know. I, we can. I can. We, I can see your name right here. I come from a realm that exists in parallel with the digital world you, that you know. It is called the Spirit Realm. Up until now, it has been completely invisible to you, as it as it is to any other. The Sarshko has run me as spirit awakened. Four eons, a eons, by all my kind have been have served the humans as guides, working together, helping those who have perished and gotten lost, becoming spirits. Trapped in echoes of existence, unable to find their way forward. I have given you the ability to perceive the spirit realm around you by binding my energy with yours. You are now, what my kind calls you, a bound. A human that is bound to the spirit of God. What I am to you. This is crazy! Realms and spirits? So you do mean like ghosts? If you want to put it that way. The spirit realm is like a bell, resting on top of the human world. When a human dies, but they cannot move, uh, move on to the afterlife, they get caught in that bell. 
the energy gets trapped in this becomes a spirit. There is always a reason to why one ends up this way. An unresolved matter from which when they were alive. Or the abilities raised to realize one's unfortunate fate. Our job is to help these spirits move on. Okay, let's say I believe you. But why do you need me? Why not just help these spirits or whatever by yourself? My kind only exists ever exists on other beings, pouring out of pure energy. You do not possess a physical body, not even the spirit realm. Therefore, it is impossible for us to make any true difference to the surrounding world. We know, as a bound, that now that, that have the means to interact between both realms, the human world and the spirit realm. Our job is to seek out and guide people like you, who, re who we deem fit for the task. And you have displayed a great deal of courage and righteousness, traits we have greatly value and throughout your life. Especially so for someone as young as, young as yourself. Yet, it's very uncommon there are and anyone to this time from their age. But something has come up. Era, there's someone who's in a dire need of your help. Okay. Now we understand something. She is waiting for you on the pier. Alright, so. That's Arco. But I mean, was Arco, who was formed out of ice things, and and now we are stuck with a being for all eternity, I think. So yeah, I'm gonna end this video right here, and uh, I'll probably meet the the um, girl up the empier later. So be sure to subscribe, hit that bell, I can turn on the notifications like this. You comment down below and I will see this later. Also I'm wondering if the woman is actually the grandma.